Hi, welcome to another episode of The Young and the Restless. We open up where we left off, where Sally walks into society. She says hello to Adam. Adam greets her sarcastically. Nick says to watch his mouth. Sally calls Adam rude after he questions that they're going to have sex after having dinner. Sally thinks that they are friends after the last time she and Adam spoke. Adam says, no, we are more than friends. Sally tells him it's his fault that she got together with Nick. We then see Noah and Ali meet up at the coffee house. Ali tells Noah that she saw him hugging Audra at the club. Noah said that they couldn't speak there. They should go somewhere else to talk. We go upstairs. We see Billy and Sharon brings Chelsea her stuff from the hotel to her new apartment. Chelsea is grateful. We go back to the club where we see Ali and Noah sit down to talk. Noah says that he didn't know she was there at the club when he was hugging Audra. Ali Ali questions his emotions that he is showing at the moment and whether or not he's confused about Audra. Back at the coffee house, we see Chelsea express that she is juggling a lot of emotions at the moment and she doesn't have a safe haven, so she's happy for the apartment. Sharon tells her that she hopes that the place will bring her the haven. Chelsea feels overwhelmed having to know have to tell Connor the truth. Lily texts Billy to meet up. Back at society, we see Sally claims that she was humiliated by Adam for breaking up with, up with her. Nick calls Adam a narcissist. Adam tells Sally that Nick only loves one person and that is Sharon, so enjoy her time. Back at Noah's club, Noah tells Ali about Audra's miscarriage. Ali questions why she would tell him about it just now. We go over to the park where we see Lily and Billy meet up. Billy tells Lily what happened with Chelsea. We go back to Sharon's coffee house where we see Sharon helps Chelsea unpack. Chelsea calls Adam and he leaves society to go outside to speak with Chelsea. We then see Nick and Sally sit to eat. Chelsea tells Adam about her new place and she asks Adam to see Connor. Adam is not happy about telling Connor about the situation at the moment. Adam wants to discuss it further. Chelsea has made up her mind and she wants to tell Connor. Back at the park, we see Lily asks Billy if what Chelsea did didn't overwhelm him. Lily then questions why Billy didn't turn to her. Back at Sharon's apartment at the coffee house, Chelsea is happy that Adam is listening to her and has faith in her. Sharon tells she tells Sharon she wants to prepare for Connor mentally as he is coming. Sharon then leaves and goes downstairs. Back at the park, Billy tells Lily it wasn't his story to share with her at the moment. Billy feels like Lily is up upset about something. Back at Noah's club, Noah expressed that he is feeling guilty about leaving Audra in London while she was going through a pregnancy. Ali asks if the news makes Noah see Audra in a different way. We go back downstairs to society. We see Sally and Nick. Sally and Nick are so boring. Um, they talk about their history and the way they grew up. Nick then assures Sally that he is not overly vested in Sharon at the moment. We then see Adam and Connor arrive at the coffee house. Sharon tells Connor that Chelsea has moved upstairs. Adam then thanks Sharon. Back at Noah's club, Noah says he feels terrible, but it doesn't change who Audra was. Their relationship was toxic, and he assures Ali that she is his present. He then grabs her and kisses her, and in comes Audra. Noah sees Audra as she leaves. 
back at society nick tells sally that the only thing that he's missing right now is his personal life and someone to be with we go back to the park lily says it doesn't matter right now what she feels she just wants to focus on chelsea billy asks if supporting chelsea is gonna be a problem lily then realize that billy was the one who saved chelsea's li chelsea's life the night at the club we then see adam and connor go upstairs to see chelsea chelsea welcomes them chelsea and connor shares a huge hug and he tells chelsea how much he misses her thanks for watching bye